sasa milicheza akafikiria mm. akasema seven mm. Diana was so shocked akasema mm. seven mm. on your life <laughs> <laughs> ni kama hiyo kidogo kwake ni kama mm. ni kama hiyo mm. kwake vile ali react na kama ni kama it was too small mm. i don't know <laughs> mimi si juu unaweza ambia mtu wako body count yako ya ukweli What's up everybody? My name is Lilesh and welcome to yet another episode on Tuko Extra. Now today again is your extended version of Chat with Lily and with two gentlemen. Let me tell you, to my Ruby Tena, the other one, hey, hey, but we are alive, we are here. I'll start from here, introduce yourself. That's your camera and there are two night words here, what you do. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Oh, you guys, my name is Brian Ajona, I'm an editor. This is my colleague. Ah. So, so, this is your, we're going to talk about it. Pale Tuko. Pale <laughs> nice. Alafu yeah. pale very good friend of mine for a long time. Yeah, yeah. kabisa. Wananitaga wana Kenry Elbis lakini kwa ugumu sana kusema Kenry Elbis you can call me Kenny. Uh, I'm an ANR a publicist, a talent manager. Vitu vingi tu ambavyo vinohusiana na biashara ya muziki lakini pia nafanya kazi na Interfine Global na Champion Studios. Ah. Yeah. Wewe yeah. wanyo Kenry Elbis kwa kikuyu tunaweza shinda sana mm. Elbis. Yeah. Elbis. Okay, so first topic. Mm. Milichebi walikuwa na jo of course da karibu ni Diamond but na Diana mm. wanakonga na YouTube channel yeah. so Milichebi na Terence walikuwa mm -hmm. featured mm -hmm. Terence akauliza bibi yake maswali zime za game night akamuuliza mm -hmm. body count yako ni ngapi mm -hmm. sasa Milichebi akafikiria mm -hmm. akasema seven mm -hmm. Diana was so shocked akasema uh. seven yeah. on your life <laughs> <laughs> ni kama hiyo kidogo kwake ni kama yeah. ni kama hiyo yeah. kwake vile ali react na kama kama it was too small yeah. i don't know <laughs> Sometimes when I say my kids, I'm going to now show you a masala ya mausiano. When I say my kumbwa, sometimes you pass so vizuri kuieleza. Sometimes when I say sini binadam, na utamu pamu tu taswira flani kuko. So na juu kwenye zako mambia mtu la bure na body count ya three, ata kuchukulia kwamba ukuwa mtu akufanya masala ya na sasa na you understand? Lakini juu kwenye zako sema ma body body count number flani kuna manamba kisa mtu tanda zako shuka juu zizi. Ani ada zaza kau pikir sebut kau mak sesak kau muka kau ni fanya dia mana kau muka ni nak kau ni kau ikut mepat. It's crazy. So sometimes, betul betul macam fikir Syria kau fenaz. Anak cik fikir fikir tu asyik. Kamu ani, mana saya mau tahu? I don't know. Good hurt you. I don't hurt you. So it's good sometimes. Ish na yo tu po. Yeah. Brian. Yo, according to me, I think it can never go beyond three. If I am to say, it will never go beyond three. Are you speaking for yourself or for the girl you want to be with? Okay, I think if uh, my girl tells me it's beyond three, eh, that is a turn off. Murifi, I'll run. Eh? Yeah. Bam, bam. <laughs> if it's beyond flag. three, that's yeah. red flag. Yeah. That is red flag in yeah. the first place. So uh, even uh, if I'm dating you and uh, we are in the process of knowing each other, yeah. I think uh, uh, it should not be beyond three. If yeah. you, you are to tell me, if you are to open up, just mm. lie to me, tell mm. me it's three. Ana sema aseme ule ule first love wa kwanza alafu ule tukapenda na pendana alafu nikamwacha alafu aliyenikosea labda alinichiti akafanya nikamwacha tumalizia alafu ndo wewe tukatulia hebu tuone kama Terence atachukua simu yetu nimuulize how he feels about Having yeah. seven, come, ah, yeah. yeah. akomteja, akomteja, akomteja yo. Mm -hmm. Anyway, yeah. but for me, I don't know. You know, body count mm. in a kwanga very sensitive topic, yeah. especially for men. Sisi dem, mm. ukinyambata, you've had G20, nini, nini. Tuko na karoho, kusema, it's okay, niko na esa. Lakini mwana umi anafikina, kusema, hey! Ile na feel pia for men to men kuzungumza kuwa na washikaji wako Ukiwambia kwa mba mila wada na body count ya mia, mia mbili Ile ni respect you know Kwa mba ni kuchapa kwa na experience Na pigia sana mpata Lakini umuelezea mwana mki uko hivo Inaleta tuwa siri wa tofauti ya naza kuwa na kwa mba Mbona huyu ni kama tatumia ilo jina ni kama wewe ni hawara Mbona mm. e. uko, uko, uko hivi sana na, 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 na watu wengi mm. Namesha kumbata tabia yako, mm. utatoshika kweli kutulia mm. Na mshua siku wanasema kumbata tabia ni ngozi you know mm. yeah. So ata kama mtu ndo vivi vina manisha, ata toshika Kichini chini za chini kakwe na kujia fanyi mambo What do you think about reaction ya Diana? Kwa zukingale mm. mbida alishtuka kusema seven, mm. your whole life mm. <laughs> uh, I think for Diana <laughs> 
mwanzo si eti ilikuwa inashtua watu sana hata reaction yake ile sio mm. mara ya kwanza maana amehusishwa na mambo mengi sana kwenye mitandao mm. ya kijamii yeah. amehusishwa na wanaume tofauti no mm. and uh, mwisho wa siku nadhani watu labda wangetarajia labda anyamaze mm. angetushtua mbona mm. Diana amenyamaza yeah. mbona hajaongea lakini wakati alishtuka tulikuwa tunatarajia mbona kwa hiyo atashtuka kwamba kumbe kuna watu wale wana body count ndogo mm. lakini pia mwisho siku tusimjaji kivu kisana labda alikuwa anashtuka mm. anashangaa ni nyingi eh labda mwisho wa siku kuhusishwa labda yeye labda wiko tatu labda ndo bahati ndo nini atuzi tukajua kama vile Ibrahim anasema tatu ndo ile nini ishanipata so we don't know lakini mwisho wa siku cha tuseme vile kwa tunarudia pale what we don't know it hurt na mwisho wa siku mbaya ambao hatujapewa tuwache mpaka jibu tutaupata ndio hii sasa eh but the kwendi Diana has mm. gone through cause Brian umesema you umetuambia um, you're a writer yeah. Diana amepitia mengi mm. sana pale kwa internet so you know, juzi yeah. the other day mm. alikuwa akiongelea leo story ya mtoto yeah. wake mpaka ikabidi bahati akami na aseme guys wacha nini ni mtoto mm. and i think it's important watu wajue yeah. if you don't like bahati you don't like Diana hiyo mm. ni yako yeah. wacha nini na mtoto wake ndio actually it should not go there be, because you know kids should not be true. Mm. They should not be just subjected to trolls. Yeah. If you are a troll, you need to like come uh, on issue na Diana or Bahati. You should not like take it to their kids. So they, I think they are nice couple. They have always uh, have this thick skin. Mm. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, thick skin. I cannot handle that. I yeah. cannot handle. To me, yeah. now I excess. Sometimes I can even be depressed. Mm. Yeah. So I'm going to fix skin. I'm going to share it. But uh, like you know, they say internet never forgets. So you are trolling a child today you are putting up something you want to compare somebody's child with somebody and like make coming up with some answers like uh, rumors that cannot be uh, confirmed yeah, yeah. you want to link a child to something Someone else, else yeah. and you know internet never forgets the child will grow they will have smartphone and uh, eventually they'll see what people are saying and you, you can't erase so Uh, hi, my message may be to those who do not like Diana and uh, Bahati they should uh, desist from like having their kids in this yeah yeah, yeah true so sababu so. na, 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 na mimi mwisho wa siku hakuna mm. uh, mtu ambaye ame hold gun kwa kwa kukwambia oh yeah nataka uongee kizuri kuhusu Diana mama mm. acha maana nataka uwapende no uh. and it's all about you kama uwapendi mm. just acha kuwafuatilia yeah. slide achana nao alafu mwisho wa siku hivi vitu ambavyo unaviona mm-hmm. do the things ambavyo wao mamua uone mm. don't know a lot about the them you know wao umeona labda ni asilimia kumi ndio wamekuonyesha mm. na asilimia kumi nafanyao wachukie huwezi mm. ukajua ukakaa nao uka interact nao ukapata asilimia 90 kumbe ni watu wazuri ambao labda kuona kwenye picha hiyo. Mm-hmm. So mwisho wa siku tunasemaga kitu kimoja kama wasawili wanasema hichi. Uh, mzigo mwenzio ni kanda la usufi. Ah, mm-hmm. Yaani kanda la usufi ni, ni, ni kitu chepesi sana. Ah. Sasa uh, v- m- matatizo ya mwenzako yanakaa mazito kwake lakini kwako yanaonekana kwamba ni kitu chepesi yeah. 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 Okay, okay. No. I understand. Hey, haya. Next ni Brown Mouse mm-hmm. 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 like <laughs> 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 mwingine kama Kiraja speaks like you by the way. I think he's your brother. Yeah. Oh, I'm related. Yeah. Nadhamu na kona. Siku kabisa. Hapo sasa umeenda sana ndugu yangu. So Brown Mouse of yeah. course is among the many celebrity couples mm. waliachana jo alikuwa na vera wakacha. Yeah. Yeah. Alafu juzi tu hivi picha akaposti alafu ameficha sura msichana lakini mm-hmm. internet media ni nani mm-hmm. wakatafutwa msichana akapata who it mm-hmm. is and they said that's the ex yeah. so now the rumor out there is that amerudiana yes. na baby yes. mama wake yule mm-hmm. mwenye kuna tutano kwanza yeah. 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 na for the longest time alikuwa you know alikuwa na anakani kama i don't talk to her i don't associate with her mimi niko na vera na nini sasa vera tena story tunasikia huko amenda yeah. ameenda overseas amerudi mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> ana, ana, anacheza levels za juu anasema <laughs> kuna nyanja za international anaenda ah, international yeah. 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 Mm. so i don't know wewe ukiangalia picha unaona kama ilikuwa ex baby mama wake unajua muda mwingine mm. na waheshimu sana netizens kama tunawaita online cds mm. mm. wale watu wana, wana kumbukumbu na historia nyingi sana vitu vingi mm. na muda mwingi kama wamesema kitu kiko hivyo mm. basi wanakijua maana unajua online cds ni, ni, ni mimi na wewe unajua mm. Mimi na, namjua lili kutoka way back you understand kuna mm. picha zako mimi nazijua kuzifuta mm. mtu akazi post mara kwambia kweli ule ile maana nakukumbuka eh unaopata eh so mwisho siku wale watu utapata ni watu wanaojua na ukaribu so they know na mwisho siku sidhani kama ni vibaya kuonekana na ex wako kama uko kwenye mahusiano mm. it's only bad ukiko kwenye mahusiano mbaya po serious mm. ama uko na na mtu lakini kama uko kwenye mahusiano we ni free person na ni upo kwenye soko unaruhusiwa kwenye soko hata kama ulikuwa umegusa ile ngoi kukufurahisha 
ukaenda kugusa nyingine unaweza kwa mtu na mungu alitangia hapa umepata ilikuwa sawa it's no bad at all uh, na, na mwisho siku tunasema kwenye kwenye maisha sometimes unaweza ukatoka sehemu uka, ukaona labda kule ndo kulikuwa greener kulikuwa vizuri lakini baada ya ku experience ukaisi kwamba ah kumbe kulikuwa bora zaidi Ebu, na, na kama kuna nafasi inapatikana hiyo sehemu ulikuwepo unarudi eh amna kibaya kabisa do you believe Vera na Brown Moses aliachana Yeah, I think so. Yeah. I believe because uh, we've seen Vera immediately they uh, went public with a uh, split. Vera went to US and uh, actually she has been partying having the best moments of her life best. over there. Yeah. And at some point she even hinted at finding love again. Oh. So uh, being that they are celebrities, they are people who are well known and uh, they are they are like uh, that uh, relationship was in the public like uh, on the spotlight. Uh-huh. I believe they they split. Hello. Hello. Hello, Sasa Brown. Sapi sapi. Naitwa Lili Aisha anakupiga kutoka tuko. Eh. Uko salama? Mama. Ah, napigia kukujulia hali unaendelea je after break up. Salama. Kwa salama kweli, break up kwa ngi painful. Mtani kupigia ni kiamu kwa nyumba. Oh, umelala? Mm. Oh, sawa. But before tumalizane nilikuwa nataka kuuliza pia mwisho. Nimekaa. Nasema Brown Mauzo. Amelala. Kwa mjaja, amelala actually. Itaniramba. Ikitamramba. Bwana anasema sawa. Ama ni stress ya break up eh. Bwana lala. Ni sasita bwana. Nasema usiku wanamaliza leso. Hii inajaa inaloa. Eka bila mzazi. Yeah. But we kweli mm. kama melala but do you remember how is he doing after the breakup yeah. amesema yeah. 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 kwa sawa eh is painful akasema kwa sawa yeah. 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 he'll call me i don't think he'll call me back but so if, but no if, if but that is anything to go by yeah. ni sawa breakup aja dispute yeah. Yeah. Eh, kuna breakup yeah. 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 ame confirm mwenyewe yeah. alafu yeah. unajua mshwa siku tunasema kwamba inaweza kakuwa labda wapo waachana muda ambao sisi tunafahamu kwenye mitandao ya kijamii ukipata mm. kwamba mtu sasa hivi yuko vizuri anaweza mpaka akazungumza akasema yuko sawa yuko sawa unapata wale washachukua muda mpaka wakahili mm. ama labda yuko kwenye maigizo yeah. umepata mtu anajaribu mm. ndio maana anajaribu kumposti picha za ex mm. kwa ajili ya kujiwaza huyu mm. nani anaonekana yuko kule marekani ana, uh-huh. ana, ana, ana pia mipicha mipicha na hanga kwa sababu ya kutaka kuonyesha kwamba i'm okay, you know? okay. Mm. so mshoshi siku tutajua lakini kadi siku, siku zinavyosonga mm-hmm. uh, anasema tutaona tunaona the way watu wanaandika kama mtu ana waambia wana kili ndefu sana mm. na naamini watatutajaji kupitia kwa wandishi wao mm. mtunazo watu kuna muda tumemwona brown amekuwa motivational speaker <laughs> tutajua ikiendelea kwa vera tukianza kuipata tutajua kwamba ndo muda sasa bana na mm. anaubuza majira ya mapenzi ndio hiyo ndio hiyo but unaweza kwa the fact that very even travel right after Ta. immediately mm. tu amesema mm. na pia i think mm. sasa anaanza kufikiria inaweza mm. kwa they split up ki a while back yeah. si ndio tunaona the thing like you said bwana yeah. tupatia what, what they, they want, want us to know true. actually at the time unaweza kwa aliachana kitambo sana ah but as you've had this good unajua mshoshi siku maana mlitangaza mahusiano kwenye mitandao pia akimalizika tangazeni ndio tujue wafuatiliaji Eh tusiko tuna tunafuatilia vitu mbaya vipo. Mm. So it's good una, na, napendea hiyo. Mm-hmm. Uh, ma celebrity wetu. Yeah. Okay, haya. Ya tatu ni Jimal mm. Kaketu mm. akaenda kafanya mm. hair yeah, transplant. Mm. So me the first time I saw it I said ah um, mtu unajua bana anapenda clout pia mm-hmm. nasema ah. Mm-hmm. Lakini kwa nini ikiwa serious mpaka mm-hmm. kichwa iko na amedungwa dungwa kabisa mm, tunaona mm, tidamu tidamu tudogo mm, mm, nikasema eh hey, wanaume mm, pressure mm, kubwa na nywele mnatoa <laughs> it was boost in confidence mm. eh, eh tunaona yeah, boost you in confidence sure sure eh i think i think mm. sibena anasema anga bad man as sexy man. but mm. now like hiyo ni yeah. we can say it in a, in a very kuna wenye mm. wanaona ni like kukuwa bald mm ni kitu kingine kwao like it lowers their self esteem mm. eh so watu kama bien wako sawa na hiyo but uh, you find kuna wenye wana feel too like oh niko na that's like my hell i have a bad day mm. head mm. tena ni kitu issue ingine ongeze lakini mm. he's so old kwanza na, na hisi kwamba mm. sometimes mm. 
pesa 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 zina mashetani yake <laughs> you know na muda mwingine wanasema nguvu ya pesa madaraka mm. na ukikuwa na, na nguvu ya pesa na madaraka ya kufanya chochote ambacho unakitaka mm. so na feel sometimes ana hela nyingi ile ndugu yetu mm-hmm. so, so, anaanza kuangalia na tatizo gani ambalo naweza nikaspend sasa small small problem swala la yani amani maana tuweze tukasema the confidence sana sana hivyo maana mwisho siku kwa muda wote yuko anakuwa mdogo kabisa mpaka anapofikia ah amefikia hapo na amekuwa hizo confidence za kufanya vitu vingi ambavyo vifanya vikubwa sana kwenye maisha yake understand so nahisi kwamba labda tu ni ni hela nyingi muda mwingine nahisi kwamba pesa ndio important imekosa kazi imekosa kazi ni gari nimenunua nina nyumba ninaishi maisha mazuri nina vacation nina pesa langu kwa pesa vizuri mtoto wako sawa fanya nini sasa kuna muda mnapata hata mtu anakaa na waza na hii simeni wangu tayari gold. But I have never yeah. seen him in bad head actually. Yeah, shit, I think ni kihara. Wote tunataka yeah. kihara ile mbele inaanza kusonga hivi nyuma. Hiyo mm. ndio inamsumbua. Inasumbua wanaume mm. of course. Yeah. But wanasemanga kihara kisonga. Hiyo mm. ni pesa. Lakini <laughs> si okay, binafsi mimi sisi kama inaweza kuwa big deal masuala ya nywele. Mm. Mm. Ila pia kibinadamu watu wana insecurities zao tofauti tofauti. Yeah, okay. Tukirudia tukitoa masuala yale na tukiongelea masuala ya confidence pia. Mm. Mm. Sometimes watu wana insecurities kwa wanaweza kuwa na fight nazo kwa muda mrefu tukaka tukafikia hiyo jamaa kumbe uh-huh. fresh kumbe alikuwa inamwangaisha you never know you never know yeah. another thing just mm. a day after that hair transplant mm. procedure mm-hmm. alifanya another surgery actually are you aware yeah, no. alifanya another surgery yeah, so lala, yeah so hey, he wants Damn. to lose he wants to lose like 20 kgs kile mm. inakufanya mimi nasemanga one thing mm. whatever makes you happy, happy. Mm. do it, it. Yeah. as long as, as long you as can as afford it na as long as pia ahudhuru mtu mwingine ndio yani kwa maana stare yako maisha yako balida so kwa stare zake tu iko sawa kama hiyo ndio story nataka ni sawa haya next story ni ya juzi tunaona kuna club pale ngong road wamesua pesa mingi sana because of taking a picture na waka post bila consent ya mtu so it became such a big topic because kwa mm-hmm. club unaingia mimi mm-hmm. i go to the club mm-hmm. unaingia kwa club na unapata kuna photographers mm-hmm. videographers mm-hmm. pia unafanya kazi ya videos and yeah, pictures yeah, yeah? Yeah. and you can sometimes mtu anachukua tu picha because ni kazi yake ameambiwa yeah. social media lazima ikae imechanga yeah. imechanga tunaonekana tuna, tuna wateja wanakuja yeah. na ni warembo ni nini yeah, kwanza yeah. there is a, a club social media warembo peke yake they don't post men mm-hmm. only women kuvutia wanaume sasa spend spend wanaume wakuja spend ma hii ndio mko na pesa sisi tunakaanga tunakula pesa hiyo so that case became because it was a millions mm-hmm. mtu mwenye alisua ameshinda a lot of millions yeah, yeah. na imeshtua ma clubs hata tukapo whisky river sasa hivi yeah they make sure now ukiingia yeah. you've consented in that yeah. kuna parliament kwa yeah. as you enter this mm-hmm. just know there are photos and pictures and videos being taken yeah. mm-hmm. kuna nyingine club na kuweka band kama yeah. utaki unavaa ka band so yeah. photographer akiona glow in the dark anasema ah unataki picha hiyo yeah. yeah. what do you think about this uh, binafsi mwanzo nimeona hizo onyo ambazo zimetolewa club tofauti tofauti mm-hmm. na mwisho siku kwanza nitataka kukushauri watu wa vilabu mm-hmm wa invest on good PR teams. Mm. Maana kuna wengine wa migeti right na kuna wengine mm. wa migeti wrong kabisa yani the way wanaongelesha unajua ni wateja na mwisho siku mtu kuchukuliwa picha mm-hmm. ni hali yake. Mm. Na kama anataka kukuja kukusupport ukiweza kumwekea vigezo ambavyo labda anahisi ataweza na navyo mm. ataacha kukuja kukusupport because it's not a must umeshanielewa. Mm. So nahisi kwamba the way waliandika zile onyo zilikuwa zingine zilikuwa ni na, zimekuja na asira sana lakini kuna hii club ambayo ili get it right ataweza kuitumia kama mfano wao ambao walikuwa na ikiwa tu risk bad risk bad ya wamesema eh toka vali kwa vali hao walikuja kaandika kabisa vizuri kwamba kama utaki utavaa hiyo nini na itaonekana yani wamekupa idhini njoo upige stare na kama utaki tutachukuliwa picha na nahisi kama hizi club si lazima uchukua watu picha maana mwisho siku kama ni biashara na mna invest kuna mamodo ambao ni wa kiume na wa kike ambao wanaweza kukuja wakaigiza na mkachukua hizo picha mm. na ikaonekana kama club kweli ipo ipo lit na kila kitu so mwisho siku it was not right kwenye ku ku kuweka tu watu bila idhini yao. Mmoja mtu anaweza kakuwa labda amesema amesafiri Dubai alafu nyinyi mkampiga picha mkapost. Kwa hapo mkaribu mambo. Shaelewa. Ama mtu labda yuko na mpango wa kando oh, spare tire yeah. unajua. Mm. Uko na spare tire yako hapo alafu unapata mshwa siku tena inakuwa eh yes, hey, yes, nani ni so, eh. It's no good. So data protection na naamini na watu wajaifuatilia sana hiyo law. Hey. Nadhani sababu ilikuwa imeintroduce recently sana. Ah uh, ila watu wakifuatilia kuna kuna vitu vingi watatajua kwamba image ya watu bila consent yao so zuri kujenga kwenye public domain but uh, according to me i think uh, you know like we are in a digital era and uh, club photography is uh, like uh, it's a digital marketing strategy, strategy. Yeah. so you know like clubs they also want to show people like uh, our club is the best come, come to our joint 
So one way they can achieve that is by that doing Pictures. club photography. Mm. So a uh, club is just like a public place. And uh, when you are in a public space, you should be ready for anything. 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 So, like, <laughs> or maybe it should be. There should be, like, uh, private clubs. But in a public club, like, uh, you know, there are public clubs. Zile to the ukienda, you expect to have crowd. So, kama hizo. Lakini wadeo tukisema wadeo ni public place. Ni public, lakini wadeo ni private. Yati ni kwa jiri ya kujia kufanya vitu viyako vya siri, ambako vifanyi ukunche kwenye muangazi. Understand. Do mana takanisa pia ni semi ya public, lakini ni semi ya siri, mana unenda kule kwa jiri ya kupata closeness na mwenyezi mungu wako, shanelewa. But to cover that, I think, what we can do, let clubs have two sections. One section ni wale wenye amekubali, like they can snap us. Sisi tuko sawa, we like, just do anything with our image, as long as that it's not defamatory, yeah. do your stuff, eh? For marketing, it's okay. Then an another segment, ikuwe ni wale wenye wanataka privacy. Miyo privacy, I think, ando kunyo kwako. Ando kunyo kwako. No, sometimes, you know, you know, sometimes, kuna watu mbao, wanataka kuwa na watu, lakini ya wajuu kwa shoshet nao vizuri. So, shinelewa, ni kata kutakabisa ipo na mtu. Ila wana enjoy kuona watu wakifanya vitu. Mm. Ila wanataka kukuwa na privacy yao. Mm. Kwa mani mina tule na relax na mwenjoy ya kifanya mm. wendazi mwaki mba watawufanya kwa kati ya kuna vile vivea kiushenelea. Mm. Mm. So, tu, tupe pia watu na fasi yu. Mana ni kala kitamba hipo ndani yao na so kupenda kwa umu. Mm. Sato wafusi vipi, asa itaka ina anact. Mm. Mm. So, sometimes tu, tuwache tukumba to understand kwa mbeko jini. Kama na fusema, kukwe na section mbili. Yeah, mm. Kama huko tuwa tulie. Yeah, yeah. 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 But yeah. I think, mm. as in, I know, you know the thing is ukisha ingia club na unajua you see on social media kila siku ndo ujua yu club kuna DJ Flani, kuna Kim, kuna Hypnotic, kuna nani ya napaform unajua because you've seen on social media so the fact that you've seen those pictures on social media unajua kwa hii club wanachukua anga picture so it's either one, ukiona photographer muambezi mi kuna times na semanga tu si leo leo yu siku zachora eyebrows ni nini makeup sina ni mekuja tu kofia usi nchukwe picture ama mkuja na mtu mwingine haa ya 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 Mi nene watu na mtu wangu, please. Sasa kwambia I don't take pictures. At that point, nuna fokus ya mano. But sasa sijui, I don't know the story of how mtu alichukulua picture, alikiwa na kaja, kifaya ni, you know, all that. But, amipata pesa mzuri. But I think, so taking, like, taking a photo of you, it's not a crime. But now posting it, that is where, like, yeah, kuna shida. But akichukua siya, anachukua ndi ya posting. A post, actually. Anyway, I don't know. We'll see how they go. Ni conversation kubo sana. Yeah, it has a lot of... Itaitaji pia an angle to fault to fault. Ata ya wana sharia to understand. Yeah. The law needs to be very... Yeah, yeah. Yes, I had to correct. It can be very new. So the law needs to be very clear how far someone can go. Ndiyo pia mwenye club asi enda ya sarara. Jiyo millions ni kitu maybe ya metingeneza in three months. Ume mkula pesa ya three months. Enorma ni atasa. Ni pesa mob sana. Aya, the last story to talk about ni... A very sad, for me it's a very sad story. Story, but mm -hmm. it's trended so much mm -hmm. uh, sana sana jana mm -hmm. uh, kuna msi chana i think alikuwa al na date mse Appa apparently was an al aspiring mm -hmm. nairobi governor, governor. Mm -hmm. and i was like mm -hmm. somebody who, who mm -hmm. would have been sakaja so imagine <laughs> that you <day> sakaja <laughs> mm -hmm. and i looked at that video and the girl hakuwa na tingika ana mm -hmm. slapi wa nasonga hivi tu hivi tu hivi tu nikama mezo ya ana mbua geto atakotu ana mbembeleza Nikasema, where are we going in this country? Where, not even a country, mm. as the world. Mm. Any um to, mm. no kisomo kenda Facebook, mi kile nifanya self course for research purposes. Mm. Kenda Facebook kadika jinake. Mm. Stories are that, baka babaki ya mengililia ikitu, mm. brothaki ya mengililia. Mm. Uh, um, chana kasema, in fact, I will quote the what she said. Mm. Yo, when she kuja mseme, oh, oh, mara, mm. eh. Mm. <laughs> What she actually said, uh -huh. babaki ya limuambi, akasema, my dad needs to apologize to mm. you for what? One thing, mm. Mm. one thing with me, mm. even my hubby knows, I mm. don't give in to sheer intimidation. Mm. I am sorry, dad, if you thought that would work on me, mm. you have to apologize and mm. talk to me nicely mm. for me to come home. Mm. My husband is my husband mm. and you have no choice mm. but to accept that fact. So, ukendele ukisoma so my story, that are easy screenshots that what you know, 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 it's not the first time this story may happen. Kuna ata time, oh, buwana, oh, buwana, kia, anamtetea, 
mm. amesema after some good beatings yeah. the security came to her rescue on the mm. eighth floor mm. where they took her down via the lift mm. Um, then Doris had to spend the night with the guards. I mm. woke up at 6 p.m. and mm. locked my door and warned the management mm -hmm. not to dare open my door to allow her mm. lest they want court trouble. Mm. Meaning, it's not the first time I'm in Chapa. Yeah. It's not the second or the third time. Yeah, mwenye ndo ameandika akasema nisha Chapa thara beating. Mm. Oja kuna beating na kuna thara beating. Yeah. Na umsichana babake ni kama lingililia na brother ake julikuwe na semekana yeah. they've come in kumsaidia ku stop this thing but she said please this is my husband. Mm. I don't know what psychological mm. problem mm. if it's a, I don't know what that is. Because mm. mimi ni kwa sema ata mtu wakinulia kidole hivi. Yeah. Uh, no bas. Uh, uh, End of it. Ah, I don't take. even know what to say. Yeah, atari. Najua mm. mwisho siku. Mimi ni mwana ile clip. Mm. And uh, kwanza ni nishituka. Kulikuwa na mtu kukule kando. Mm. Alikuwa react kabisa. Mm. Ani ya metulia na jiangalia utafitia na watch movie ya kiini. <laughs> yani <laughs> wanele ya <laughs> mindi. Yeah, 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 yeah. Kabisa. <laughs> And if that means your business was a person. person. <laughs> Lakini pia najiuliza ule jamaa aliyekuwa anampiga kwenye kiwango kile na kwenye vibe ile mm. na aogopi mm. na maanisha kwamba ni kitu ambacho amekizoea kama unavyosema mm. because kama unaweza kumpiga mtu vile public kwenye bedroom inakuwaaje unampiga vipi ushanelewa mm. lakini pia ule mtu unapata amepata kiburi cha kukupiga hivyo mm. sababu tayari kama unasema familia imehusishwa ndugu yako mm. ameona kwamba umewakataa ume, ume kuwasikiliza ndugu yako mpaka na babako mzazi anajua kuna popote utaenda so mwisho siku uta, utabaki hapo so ni, ni kitu ambacho kinauzunisha lakini pia nasikia wataalamu wanasema kwamba hiyo ni condition fulani ambayo wewe unamkumba mtu anajipata kwamba mm. eh, anataka kukaa hivyo ana enjoy your pain and stuff Place, uh, place, yeah. Hmm. So, ni ni atari sana. It's very, it's a disturbing video actually. Uh, yeah. It's a disturbing. In as much as you are not related to the girl, but yeah. you can feel for her. Yeah. Because yeah. those slaps yeah. were loud. Were loud. Sana, it's loud. Labda la, la, atakuwa mtoto wako, labda mdada la, yako, mm. mshanelewa. And mm. uh, sometimes wanaambia mtu, mm. ukihisi kwamba uko kwenye mahusiano na huyo mtu unafikia place ya kumpiga, mm. achana naye. Hey, Just go. Just go. Na wewe pia ukihisi kwamba umefikia sehemu unapigwa, ondoka, nenda maana kwenye vita huwa kuenda kukuwa vizuri mm. itakuwa vita vita mtu atakuja kwa nasira achukue aenda kuchukua vitu ambavyo havikufa ikakuwa sasa ni kesi nyingine mkapata watu wanashia majengo ya serikali mimi hey. naenda jela mwingine yuko mochari hey, yeah. 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 point one zile tunaonanga news kila saa somebody yeah. stabbed somebody yeah. 25 yeah. times yeah. 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 that's hiyo hasira na kufikishanga yeah. hapo yeah. and it's hapo. so dangerous so it's no good at all yani ukisi imefikia hapo acha acha ondoka kabisa mm. nenda ya mm. ana Ni mtu umpende unajua kitu ambacho unakipenda uwezi ukataka. Uwezi ukiwaribu. Bata mama yako baba yako wewe ufanyie hivyo. Could you love them? Yeah. Mm -hmm. so, right. Okay, okay. Like uh, the video like uh, attracted uh, massive reactions and uh, like Kenyans were like calling for the authority to take action. And uh, yeah. after some time we like we saw I don't know if it's a a, a, a factual post but we saw like the guy was telling people not to judge them, not to to keep their comments for themselves. So I want to just to ask you, Lily, do you think like when I'm having my wife and we are in a, in a, like a, we are having issues, mm. we are fighting, we are even fighting in public places. Do you think uh, uh, when like uh, people are commenting and judging us, is it okay or like, what do you think? Like the guy thinks uh, people should not keep comment quiet. about it, but they did it in a public place. Yeah. It was in a public place, the video went viral. Mm. And again, you know, like we are human. We are told that today if I kill somebody, I'll be like, uh, the case will be, the, the state will be. Yeah. It's not, I cannot say that, oh, the person has decided to forgive me, or the family of the person has decided to forgive there me. The now state. I can go without it, the state. Yeah. So your life belongs to the state. Yeah. So in as much as he's feeling that people should not comment about it, uh, like what do you think about that? Like, do you think we yeah. have a say? I think, you know, the thing is, probably Mstana, mm. what she needed was mm. us to come and now help her. Mm. Probably I'm mm. kichapwa sana mm. and she doesn't know what to do. Like, umesikia vile anasema, mm. asha, babake, amemtua uko, amemtua bradhake, amemtua family. So she's, it's, it's her and this guy. Okay. So this video being posted and people commenting, it's not because mm. we want to be in your business. It's uh. because we're like, who can save this girl? Okay. Who, who will help her? Because clearly, we're not helpless. Ndu, me, I'm not going to be able to help her. Ata hapigi nduru. Unajua kichapu wanafanya. Shu, anika amezoya. Anachapa, anasonga tu hivi. Vile tu anachapa. So I believe we have a right. Not a right, but we. 
it's opinion. okay. Yeah, it's, it's yeah. good for us to have the opinion. Yeah. Probably we're the ones to save this girl. Sure, sure. I'm a unknown as well. Kicho chote ambacho kipo kwa macho wa binadamu waneza kwa kiona, anakuwa na opinion nacho. Mm. Endo manata tukiangalia kamera, unezo kwa na opinion na hiwa kamera ina, inafaika. Yeah. Hivya, yeah. so, mm. tunaruhusiwa. Ani kibinadamu, mm. lazima mtu wawe na maoni ya kitu fulani. But also, so either positive or negative. There is something. Uh, uh, yeah. There is something. You can be in a problem, mm. but... Uh, you don't know you are in a problem. Exactly. But someone else can see, see. you are in a yeah. problem. Yeah. Yeah. So maybe it could be that. Yeah. 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 It could be seen that yeah. time said you omstana iyote yeshe. I think after this I don't believe mm. unless this guy I don't know I don't know but I don't believe at a chapo omstana tena hivi. Maybe uko ndani ndani lakini kama ni kitu amezoea. Ni danger. Sister Doris, I think her name is Doris. Please leave. Me I'm advocating for mm -hmm. something like kena amesema jiondoe. Ukiona things are not there because clearly you know what is right and what is wrong. Mm. Nunajua kuchapo is not right. Mm. Na ukiona in evil, please just leave whether you are a man or a woman. Mm. Because pia mtumba manjuzi akasema anachapwa na watu anamkejeli kabisa anasema wanaume nakubali kuchapwa mpaka he's afraid kwenda police station because anajua huyu mwanaume ataniambia enda huko kaa na bibi yako muoneshe ndio mwanaume. And it's so sad. Yes. And it's happening to both so genders yeah, not yeah, just the yeah, women. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so I'd me advocate mm. kat, kitu ni mbaya waachana na wewe ondoka tu tafadhali. Yeah. Yeah. Respect yourself. Yeah. Respect but yourself. but yes. there could be secret behind it behind it but what Maybe is the behind guy, someone the being guy beaten? is generous could be the guy is generous so, right? so you'll be beaten like, he can't control himself when uh, angry but now to the mm. other side the, the other side of him is generous is spoiling you giving you like uh, money you yeah, know there are comments like that on twitter that some mama natetea udoris mtampatie umeisha wewe you remonda na mpatia and i'm like it's not worth it sister it's not it's not there's a good man who will treat you well there. Tafta Ken Bana. Uwa kuna pesa. Tafta wana hata kuchafa. Okay. Yeah, I think these are the training topics of the week yeah, yeah. and asante ni sana kukuja in your opinions. Tumesikia yeah. Bron Mozo at least ya mechukua simu Terence alikuwa mteja would yeah. like to know what his opinion is. Terence if you watch this movie, kuja hapo kwa comment section utuambie. Mm. Kama 7 ilikuwa kidogo ama ni nyingi. Yeah. Na Diana your reaction was it that it's too much or too little? Yeah. Uh, we don't know. Yeah. Because your reaction, we didn't know where you stand. Yeah, but yeah, asante ni sana. Yeah, um, Tukimazia mneza tuwembeo tuwa pata aji social media. Mta kitaka kupata yeah. good wisdom on A&R. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah, true. Kabisa, uh, kwenye mitendewe kijemi yote, I go by the name Art Ken Relbis. Mm. Uh, na mwisho siku hii ni kwa jiri ya, ya wasani na biyashara zote mbazo wanitaji maswale ya digital marketing. Lakini kwa wasani mbo pia wanitaji A&R services, mm. uh, media marketing na kila kitu. Na tucheki at Interfine Global na pale tunakisha kwa mba tuta come to your rescue kwa njili ya kukisha kwa mba mtuvia kwa vina nasaa. Yeah. Yo na amini, I can attest to that yeah. is a hundred. Yeah. Amekua kwa industry for a very long time yeah. kwa mba anailewa what you need and what you don't need. Yeah. Na wewe Brian. Mimi Brian na John eh. <laughs> On Facebook, Instagram, everywhere. Brian na John na. Eh? Mm. I'm a, a writer. I'm an editor at Tuko and I do entertainment stories. So like if you're a celebrity, you're a content creator, or you want to go viral, you want to people to see like what you're doing. Reach out. Reach out. Brian yes. will make you famous. Brian yeah. is a top writer at Tuko the no, CEO dot K. Ah, <laughs> <listen, laughs> tell them Brian. This Brian is, is more single. This is eh? <laughs> 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 no, mm. uh, uh, I'm a uh, single boy. <laughs> so you put him to say three months yeah. later I'm fine your show. Everything is okay. Mm. Is filthy rich. I love it. Thank you very much, guys, for giving me your time and for yeah. coming here and for your opinions. Yeah. Mm. Again, I'd like to put a disclaimer that any opinion that has been shared by these people is theirs and does not belong to Tuko. This is their opinion and this is what they have to say and it's not any aligned to Tuko. Thank you very much, guys, for being with us throughout this whole episode. My name is Lily Aisha from Brian, Ken, and I'm Nasema Kwaheri. Goodbye. Inshallah. Inshallah. Yeah.